Hi. Hi. What's your name? I'm Mel. Mel? Nice to meet you. You just walked right up. What do you like, Lamborghinis? This is my baby, honestly. Like, it took me so long to get this car. Yeah. Like, uh, check it out. Actually, I just got my wheels redone. These are 48-inch rims. I don't mean to, you know, flex, but bigger is better, right? So, uh... <laughs> wow. Yeah, I mean, they're $50,000 each, of course. I mean, you Jesus. know... Jesus. They just got the interior redone. Brand new paint. I mean, you can take it for a ride if you want, but just yeah, just be nice with it, okay? What kind of car do you have? Do you have a Lamborghini or, uh... I have an Audi convertible, so oh. that's my baby. Ooh, okay, it's okay. nice. That's cool. That's cool. Um, yeah. What do you do? You look like a, like a like a yoga instructor or something like. That's crazy. I am a yoga teacher. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, you're your yoga teacher. Yeah. That's dope. Okay. That's bring dope. Light to the world. Really? Yeah. Okay. Well, maybe you can bring some light to my world. You know, like <laughs> you're gorgeous. Honestly, like uh, maybe we can we'll grab a bite to eat or like uh, something. I'm headed to the gym right now, actually. The gym's like a few miles away. What are you gonna walk? I'm taking the bus. Oh, my car the bus? is in the shop right now. How about like I just kind of give you a ride? Like obviously, like it's two miles away. It's better than riding the bus. Come, come right now. Just do me a favor. Just do me a favor. I want you to sit in the car and I want you to imagine yourself driving this baby. Five seconds. And once you get into the car, you're not gonna wanna come out. Like I could just be nice and give you a ride. No weird stuff, you know, just like. I'm sorry, it's just like I'm like thinking about my boyfriend right now. He would not like this. Really? Yeah. Are you sure? I mean, like, it's really not even that big of a deal. <sighs> I mean, like, I won't tell him. <laughs> no, I mean, I, it's cool. I understand. If you want, like, you can, like, call your boyfriend or text your boyfriend. I'll tell him it's no funny business. And um, I'll just drop you off over there. It's better than riding the bus, honestly. Like, you can FaceTime him the whole time. Like, uh, you're, you're loyal. Like, I just, I feel bad letting you ride the bus at this point. No weird stuff. Let's just, you know, it's around the corner. I mean, you might as well. And like I said, just FaceTime him. Like, it's cool. I guess, I guess that's okay. It's, like, just right around the corner. Just right around the corner. Call him yeah. FaceTime right now. Okay. Here. Uh, here. Okay, bro. She said that she wanted to be with you, bro. Man, I don't care what she says, about what she doing. She said that she wanted to be with you, my boy. It didn't man, work. Man. Bro, listen, listen. Man. No, no, no. Hey, I hey. don't want to hear none of this shit. She was explaining to me that she just visited your family in Nigeria, bro. Like she wants to marry you. I literally just kind of felt bad that she was riding the bus, but she she passed the I test, bro. I want to see the tape. I want, like, bro, bullshit. it's on the tape. Hey, hey, come, bro, come. It's it's over. On camera right now, this was like a kind of a gold digger test type of thing that your boyfriend wanted to do. But I believe No, no, she passed it. She passed it. I still haven't seen the tape. Like, it looks like she fell. I cannot believe that. What did you tell me? I you can't believe me? you. No, no, no. Yeah. I just was trying to give her a ride. I swear to God, she passed it. I'll show you the tape. I'm I mean, not even kidding. No. I wanted her to fail, but she didn't. Bro, this is your idea. Man, honestly, I have faith in you. I said, my girl's not about to fail this test. You embarrassed me in front of everybody. Oh. Get in the fucking car. I, I can't believe you wanted to the car. What if I got some girl's car? Boy, you gotta relax. I didn't think she, she was going to, but she really did. Like, you guys' relationship is really, really strong because uh, I tested her bro and she really didn't pass. So, if anything, Well, you don't you really know that because, I mean, she's loyal. You don't know if he's loyal. Oh, exactly. well, she's loyal. I'll pass the test. Yeah, I'll pass the test. Yeah, I'll pass the test. I should have tested him. Yeah, hey, yeah. hey, hey, <laughs> hey, test him next time. Okay. All right, bro, but hey, I'm sorry, right. bro. Sorry, and no hard feelings, bro. Come all on, right, bro. No hard feelings, bro. Man, we all fans. It's all good. Come on, bro. Like, all right, so basically, uh, just to give you guys a little context, this guy was a fan of ours. Um, he hit us up to kind of test his girlfriend, see if she's a gold digger. She passed the test. She really did, but... um. I was very surprised to see her even get in the car. No, so, I, like... I completely understand. Honestly, <laughs> I would probably do the same thing. I love my girlfriend, so I'm right there with you. But she did pass the test, and you guys should be way stronger because of this. I think he told me that you guys were trying to start a YouTube channel. You do YouTube, right? I do YouTube, and then we're trying to like, do a couple channels, a couple channels together. Okay. Yeah, I have my main YouTube. It's Mel's Creations. Um, so that's my Instagram and my YouTube. Mel's Creations. M-E-L-S-P-I-R-A-T-I-O-N-S. These guys are 
are amazing. I love them and I'm really sorry and follow them. They do dope, dope, dope content.